Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Play Ginger Cook. So today I would like to work on a couple small things in the house and then I would really really like to go and start mining in Lilith because I want to get on that road to Silicium so that way we can start working with electronics and all of that stuff. But the couple of small things that I want to get done today is uh, I decided, I mean, I messed around with the roof. Last episode, we put in this roof and I messed around with it a lot off camera. And this one kind of grew on me. This is the one that we ended with last episode. Uh, and it kind of grew on me. So I think we're going to keep this one. And then I also fiddled around with this little out piece. I made it a little bit larger, gave it a bit of a curve. I'm not sure if I like this still, so I might continue messing around with that. It just looks kind of weird how it curves, so I might make it a little a little shorter again and just straight instead of having that weird curve. But I think it will also look good once I get the next building in to the left of it and it'll kind of blend in a little bit more there and it'll look less by itself and alone so that will get fixed with time but what i want to do today is a couple different things last episode i said that i was going to give food to the animals and i completely forgot to make some so that is the first thing that we are going to do today and we actually need to go over into our kitchen here and I got all the supplies ready. I ground out some wheat. And then this is just the grass that I kind of have as long with the apples or along with the apples. So we'll go ahead and put this here. I think this is what it is cooking well. And we're just going to make as much as we can. Yep. And we ended up with 39. I think there's four different animals is that correct and animal food you can just feed to any and all animals i'm not sure about like dogs and cats so we'll have 10 10 and 9 or 10 10 10 and 9 sure uh we will give the 9 to the chickens because i feel like chickens eat the least but who really knows i wonder if the animals i've never actually tested this before i wonder if the animals all eat at the same rate they're probably gonna eat that animal food pretty darn quickly though um what was i saying oh i'm not sure if you can give animal food to like dogs and cats and bunnies and birds and whatnot uh, but we have that done now and the next thing that i want to do is uh the new roof that i put in and i think even the roof to the right the roof over like the portal rooms i'm not sure if those have it on either um these little house slabs these house slabs make it so that snow does not gather on my roof which i do not enjoy nor do i appreciate so i'm gonna take those two off and i think this one because snow should not be able to reach those and i'm gonna keep this one on just in case because i think i'm gonna make this a little bit shorter so i might need that one eventually so right now we are sitting at four and then uh, we have a couple spare palm block, thatch block things that we are going to use to make a couple more. No, don't use the hammer. And uh, a couple people have asked me how you actually get the palm leaves to make these. If we go into the Mason bench, you need, uh, let's see here, right here. You need these palm leaves and it would make sense if you found found them in seth that would make a lot of sense because there are palm trees in seth i believe the trees are actually called palm trees but you actually need to um how do we want to get up here i think maybe oops maybe this way yes okay i think we're here <laughs> uh you have to make a straight up terror world not an adventure world and you have to customize it to have um the summer biome in it and then that will in the summer biome there will be palm trees and things that you need and this doesn't have any of the half slabs so we will throw a couple on there i don't have any more for today so maybe in the future i will collect some more go ahead and get rid of this dirt block and now i think i'm pretty much done in here so we can actually head over to lilith now i guess i'm gonna go ahead and just dump the couple of things that i have in my inventory though get rid of those and then i believe these are supposed to go right here and then i just don't really care where this stuff goes you can just chill in there sure and then we can walk over Ooh fox i won't kill the fox uh do, do the foxes drop anything rare though is the question nope they just drop leather okay well sorry fox and lilith here we come ba -da -da -da. so i'm really hoping that we don't die 
because uh, Lilith is not the most forgiving world ever. Lilith is where things really start to get real. And I'm thinking I might have to make a set of mithril tools because you can see this is taking a really long time to break blocks. So I might end up doing that soon. Uh, but as we mine down here briefly, I wanted to talk about, uh, again, in last episode, I tried using a different recorder than what I usually use. And I think I've come to the consensus that I am just going to continue using my capture- oh, 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 mobs. Get out of here. Get out of here, mobs. These guys are real annoying. But I think I've come to the consensus that I'm going to continue using my capture card, which is what I am using currently. The other one just lags a little bit too much, which I think is fine. Like, no one complained about it when I live streamed. So, I think I'm going to keep the mirroring program for when I live stream, and I'll keep the capture card for when I just record my normal videos, so that way it will cut down on lag a little bit. Um, I'm just hoping that my little adapter doohickey doesn't get too bad and it doesn't disconnect too much because every once in a while it gets an attitude and it just decides to uh, not record sometimes. And lastly, the last thing that I wanted to talk about is I'm sorry for the lack of videos over the last couple of days. I think it's been two or three days since my last video and that is because I got a game called Rocket League and I'm not really going to explain it. Well, when I explain it, it sounds dumb. It's basically you're a car and you're playing soccer, which sounds dumb, but it's like so addicting and it's really, really popular on Twitch right now and just in general, really. And I've just been kind of addicted to it over the last couple of days. And then yesterday I was also out of town. So that is why. But uh, yeah, yeah. Anyways, sorry for the lack of videos. Hopefully they will get back to normal over this next couple of days. But I- ooh, ooh, is that Silicium? Silicium kind of looks like iron, so I'm not entirely sure. Is that Silicium? I don't think it is. We'll mine it just in case, but I'm pretty positive that it's not. And it's iron. Okay, so I'm going to keep mining here. The goal here is just to find silicium so that way we can get a bench going as well as get a couple electronic things. Kind of like the basics of pressure plates. I actually don't think you need silicium for pressure plates, but you need the bench, which you need silicium for. Uh, but I'm going to keep mining here and then if I run into anything interesting, I will get back to you. <gasps> oh my. God, yes, oh my god, this was not nearly as hard as I thought it was gonna be. So we can at least get the bench made today. Uh, how many did we get? We got, uh, three? Three? Uh, where did they go? Three! There we go. We got three silicium lumps, so we will at least be able to make the bench today. Uh, I'm actually really not far, that far underground at all. I found a really low leveled crate, so I thought I was further underground than what I was. And there's a little bomber dude around. And my capture card just stopped again. Let's go ahead and open up this chest. Yep, there's nothing really in there. I think I'm going to just continue mining away, because like I said, I'm not super far underground right now. And uh, then I will get back to you with something interesting. Hopefully some more silicium and a bomber dude got rid of my dang path. Okay, I will be right back. Alrighty guys, we are coming up here on a biome and this one actually seems it's either a cluster of the same biome or it's a very, very large biome and I might be a bit of a wuss and click out a lot during this uh, biome because I broke my weapon and I just have this really really crappy copper one But this seems like a really cool biome I did run into another one a while back that I didn't end up recording just because it was rather anticlimactic. so there are a couple items in my inventory from that, but it was really nothing to look at it had like a couple um, Half slabs in it and that was really it, but I really really like these half slabs. They look cool especially with this black dirt whatever oh black dirt good name good name very self-explanatory nope that doesn't drop anything i'm definitely gonna pick up some of this black dirt though because it looks cool especially with the items that are in here and i like this brick too very nice 
Um, I know there's a bomber dude in here. Okay, I'm gonna click out, click back in. I don't want him destroying stuff. You can always tell when there's a bomber dude because, well, for one, the screen kind of shakes for a second. And then also you can see where there's no background blocks. That means that there was a bomber dude there. Let's go ahead and just jump down here. There is a chest, but I don't have any keys. I'm actually almost full. I did not realize that. Um, so we are not gonna open up that chest. It's, I think it's only a silver key anyway. Oh, no. No. Oh, man. And there's a mythray one. I will have to try to mark that and then get back to it at a different time. Just because I don't feel like going all the way back up to the surface and coming back down. Is that silicium up there? No, that's just iron. Let's go ahead and pick up this tree. Just kidding, because we are completely full. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of... The random tools and things. Is there anything else I can get rid of in here? I do kind of want to keep the potions. We can get rid of the bombs. Um, we can get rid of the nails. Uh, this little baby bomb here. Pick this stuff up. I don't think these drop anything. Yeah, we can just ignore them. I don't really care about that tree thing. These drop things. I think I picked one up already. Uh, and kill this little rat dude. Oh god, and there's a bomb dude. <laughs> I lost uh, a little essence there, but that's okay And this continues down dang. I think there's yeah, there's some pillars up here I want to grab these pillars real quick my uh, pick also broke So I'm now using my mithril one which is actually going to break soon as well And I think I'm gonna go ahead and drink one of those potions I saved just to get my health back up a little bit more in case something drops on me and let's see here what else is down here i'm actually really happy with the stuff that i've gotten so i think next episode we will definitely be able to decorate okay i'm gonna pussy out of this one too uh, i think next episode we will decorate the lilith room i still need to collect some more things for the zeno room i didn't really collect very many things from um, Zeno biomes when we were there last so definitely need to do that I want to collect a little bit more of this brick But is there anything else over here or is it just dirt? It's just dirt. Let's go ahead. Let's grab this. Maybe it has a key in it uh, Probably not um, Doesn't look like it click out click back in I also picked up this trinket from a mob It is a spore trinket. It was just like I don't know. It was like a little circle blob but it wasn't like a slime it was like white or gray and uh, I dropped this trinket it's a little underwhelming not definitely not gonna wear it and will these drop things yes I'm not sure what the purpose of these are probably nothing um, that's kind of the annoying thing in junk jack X there are a lot of plants that do diddle squat but uh actually nope it's not a reagent it's just an object so yeah they're pretty pointless especially if they don't drop anything maybe it does grow something but since i clicked out and clicked back in it was gone so let's go ahead i'm gonna put a bunch of torches in this area will i be able to see it nope i probably will not be able to see it from my path but i will try to mark the path so that way maybe I will remember, hopefully. And is this silver? I'm pretty sure it's silver. Yeah, it is. So far, I have not gotten any bridges yet. So I don't know if there's a rare bridge to collect or not. But I will keep looking. I think I'm actually... Where is my path? It's up here. I think I might stop mining soon, though. Just because my mithril pick will die shortly. But I am going to mine just a little bit more. See what else I can find. If there is any other biomes to find. Which I'm sure there are. I haven't really explored Lilith too much. Just because I haven't. This is the first. Oop, I'm using the wrong tool. This is the first season where I have gotten to Lilith. But uh, during the update video. I didn't really explore it too much. I was mostly just looking for Silicium. Which thank god we found some already. But I'm going to continue mining here, and I will be back with you. Alrighty, I found one more biome, and it looks like it might be kind of small, but we haven't ran into it yet. And get rid of, get rid of you, get out of here, get out of here. Did he die? I'm not taking damage, so he must have died. Okay, let's check this out. It does have a chest in it. It's a gold key. Don't have a gold key, so I will try to mark this one as well. 
I don't want to deal with that guy, so I will just click out. Uh, we'll mark it when we leave. But there's this cool light hanging from the ceiling, which I really want to get. And is that silicium? I can't tell because it's in the background block, but we'll grab it. We'll see what it is. Grab these half slabs as well. It doesn't look like there's any bridges in here, but we'll keep looking. There has to be at least one bridge. I feel like there needs to be one bridge. And what will that drop us? I, I'm assuming you can't stack it. A silicium torch. It would make sense to find silicium in a silicium biome, maybe? No, get out of here. I don't want to go to game center. Okay, I have a feeling, I have a hunch that this is silicium. Please be silicium. We have three currently and it's silicium. Sweet, we have six now. I didn't even know that this was a silicium biome or that there were any silicium biomes. Silicium is a weird word. You know that? Let's go ahead and pick these two weird blocks up. I feel, are they gonna like drop anything? Okay, that one looks like that. Um, what can I get rid of? I will get rid of sticks. Pick that up and you are a different block as well. I was wondering if they were the same block, but they just had different textures. So there, I can eat the banana. There we go. Pick that up. There's a mob. Get out of here. And I think that is it. Yep, there's just water. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get back to the surface now. Will this drop anything? Possibly. Nope. Uh, I'm going to get back to the surface though and I will mark this now. How do I want to mark this? I still have to be able to get out of here though. Uh, let's go ahead. Just put some torches around. But I will be right back. Alrighty, we are back in our house and we are going to right away throw some silicium into our furnaces because and i just want to check just to check real quick okay so yes we do need to do this and then i'm assuming we can make the bench yep with this we need three of them so uh oh our inventory though oh oh our inventory though <laughs> that's a little bit messy let's see here can we just get um what do we need to do exactly? We just need to separate this. So I just need a little bit of room to separate them. We will separate them into two chunks. I believe you you have to smelt them. Oh, there's no coal in here either. Oh, my inventory. <laughs> um, let's see here. Go to here. I think you need to smelt them down to do anything with them, frankly. Uh, let's just go ahead and smelt all, the, all of them down and throw you in there and i have no coal in here either why do i have no coal in either of these uh can i grab you can i put like you in there for a hot second split you put you in there i'm definitely not going to keep all of my coal in these but for now we will throw the coal in there and uh let's go ahead and maybe clear out our inventory a little bit the problem is is that pretty much everything in my inventory i don't have yet and so there's really no spot for them currently. So I think what I'm gonna do is I will be right back. I'm going to clear out my inventory, see what I can put away, stash different places, and then I will be right back. Okay, I didn't get my inventory completely cleared out, but I got it cleared out enough that we will be able to do things with it. Let's go ahead and take some of this coal out so I don't completely forget about it. And now do, what do I want to throw in here? We will throw some antenium in there and again take some of this coal out. I meant to put the 70 in the other one and not the 230. There we go. And then we will throw the gold in there. And there we go, getting things smelted. So now we have six of these refined silicium. And now we need to grab some iron balls and then we just need wood and then we'll be able to make it, which is exciting. Uh, let's see here, bench, anvil, which we need to jump up here because of the dumb update that broke it. Go ahead and make this. I am indeed at an anvil. I'm standing with an anvil. Enroll is in my presence and just go like this and then we need some wood and then a boom just kidding a boom there we go yay 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 so now we actually have all the benches again i think that was an achievement i don't actually remember but i have no idea where i want to put it so i think that's actually something that we can put in the new building is we can kind of make an area for um, this new machine thing. I guess I will put it right there. It's in the kitchen. Oh, well, it's at the dining table currently But now we can make a bunch of different things, which I don't think we're gonna do today 
We are still a little short on silicium to really do much. We can do some of the basic things though. Um, like this, I guess. I guess a pressure, a pressure pad, not a pressure plate does take silicium, but we have enough to do it. And these make 50 of each, so we could probably make sets of both of these and then be fine because a majority of the stuff, I guess a lot of the stuff does take some just refined silicium. But I think the basic things really just take these little um, transistor things. So I think we'll be fine if maybe we make just some of those. We'll definitely make some of the red ones just so we can get like a pressure plate. Uh, do both of the lights take, yeah, both of the lights take refined silicium. That's just a straight up light bulb. And then this one is an RGB, so this one changes colors. So yeah, and I think soon I will go into creative on my own and just kind of figure out exactly how I want to cover up wiring because that's kind of a new challenge is just covering up wiring for lighting and things because if you put wiring up to a light that was here, for example, you'd still be able to see the wire coming up from behind the chest because unfortunately the way the wiring works, it's like on top of everything. So unless it's an item that's sitting in front of it, the wire will go in front of everything. So I think the wire would go in front of the half slabs, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but I'll have to mess around with it, see what can cover it up. Something that might work is you might actually be able to cover up with like a chain or something. And I actually found a glitch where you can make chains hover on their own. So maybe you can cover it up with a chain, but we'll see. I will mess around with it, but I think that is going to be about it next episode hopefully we'll be able to try at least a couple things out we won't be able to make a ton of lights but we'll be able to try a couple things but that's gonna be it thank you for watching this episode of let's play Trin -trin 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 please like and subscribe and all that stuff and thank you goodbye